Welcome back to the Perspective, Siraj. Uh, Digital Consumer Survey 2015. Um, you you spoke earlier about the the main goal. Now let's talk about the the first trend that 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 uh, you found here. Uh, how there's a word here called screenager. Uh, we actually did this research across uh, global markets, mm -hmm. and Indonesia was one of the core markets. Mm -hmm. And what we found in Indonesia and other parts of the world is that uh, people are now using multiple devices. Right. You know, they, they're actually used to multiple screens. You know, right. it can be their mobile screen, it can be their laptop. Their tabs. It can be their tabs, mm -hmm. it can be their iPads. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's where we've actually coined the term. You know, it, it, it was in use previously, mm -hmm. but we are trying to bring it back. It's called mm -hmm. screenagers. Mm -hmm. Okay. So screenagers are essentially people who use multiple devices. Mm -hmm. And, 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 and they're very comfortable in, in accessing information via multiple screens. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So that's the first trend which we found. Mm -hmm. And in an Indonesian context, we actually find uh, in places like Jabotak, mm -hmm. in places like, like Jabotabek, there are actually many customers who are screenagers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so, uh, what do you what do you feel is the need for people to have more than one screen? I mean, mobile. This is a mobile in, in a good size that it could actually b pr pretty much present or allows you to read news or or access information. Uh, of course, when you come back home, then you would want to. Is it is it visual wise or is it the ex digital com uh, uh, experience that they're they're seeking for? Uh, I think it's a it, it's a combination of two things. One is mobile will be your primary device for communication. Yeah. Okay, and and for actually using uh, using a mobile to connect with your family, right. with your friends on your social media channels. Right. Uh, your uh, tabs can 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 actually be the preferred device for you to watch movies. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and, and and usually the the laptops are the preferred device for working because right. if you're working you'll be using multiple applications Correct. you know you'll be using PowerPoint word mm -hmm. uh, and that's why people use multiple devices mm -hmm. but the preferred device of communication is mobile, mobile and and that is going to be the future okay now how do you think business can businesses should should move towards um, adapting their their uh, content into different screens because then when it comes to different screens it comes out um, differently how how can they leverage from from uh, the screenagers. Okay, uh, see, uh, screenagers are all experience driven. Mm -hmm. So when you are actually coming up with a content strategy, you actually need to ensure that your content is content uh, consistent across all the different multiple screens. Right. Uh, if you are looking at a mobile, because of because of the smaller screen, it has to be much more functional. Right. But when you are going on your tab or when you are going on your on, on your laptop, it's more experience dri mm -hmm. driven. You know, that's mm -hmm. where it's got to be much more visual driven. Mm -hmm. So when when a company is actually doing their content strategy, they got to keep in mind not just what, they, what they're going to communicate, but also the devices on which the... How it will respond to the different yes, devices. Yes, uh, So you, you're going to have to create a... Uh, developers have to, to be more responsive. Yeah. Um, now coming to this is uh, uh, your second trend, uh, the, the number of uh, technology users and digital services uh, that, ha that, that wishes for a better uh, digital experience? Uh, with, with the dominance of, of digital, mm. uh, consumers are now accessing information in real time. Mm. And they expect companies to respond to them in real time. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, mm -hmm. uh, if you're actually going to call either a telecom company or a mm -hmm. bank to get some services and mm -hmm. if you have to go through the entire consumer care line, mm -hmm. it takes you anywhere between three to five minutes. Mm -hmm. But consumers want to cut short that time because they believe time is very, very critical. Mm -hmm. So in the digital days, uh, if they're going to use their mobile devices, they're actually expecting companies to respond much more faster. Mm. And that's where there is an opportunity for companies to actually build an entire ecosystem mm -hmm. of getting back to the customer much more faster and thereby retaining the loyalty and the relationship with the customers. Mm -hmm. And we have clearly seen custo uh, companies which respond as soon as possible to customer requests, they, they, they actually maintain the relationship, relationship with, with the customers much more longer. Okay, but this, is, this also entails, it means that the, the, the country, for so, so Indonesia, you, your research says there's 74 million um, uh, middle class consumers in Indonesia and this will increase in 2020. Hmm. And 93% of them are actually, uh, they own um, a mobile mobile phones and 77% of them are using smartphones. Yeah. Now this has to be supported with the infrastructure, isn't it? We, we go back again to, to, to that uh, core uh, that we've, Jokowi and the public has been talking about, the, the infrastructure, broadband, uh, 4G, uh, now uh, there's 4GLT, 
Uh, there's so many out there uh, for the consumers to to benefit from. Yeah, absolutely. I think I think the government is making the right investments. So uh, I think the Palapari, you know, the yep. the, the fiber optic uh, yep. project. Yep. Uh, once that comes into play, I think it's actually going to connect uh, Indonesia much more effectively. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I think the Indonesian is going, government, government is making the right movement because they, they, they clearly believe that infrastructure is the future of digital economy mm -hmm. and, 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 they, and, and, and they are making the right investments. Okay. All right. We'll get to the other trends after the short break.